Charles with Academy Treff, and we are here in Pottstown, Pennsylvania for the kickoff of the Low Show. Starting out at Red Horse Motoring Club, pretty soon this place is gonna be jam-packed with really awesome Volkswagens. Uh, let's go inside though, because that's where the action is happening right now. So I'm here with Chuck, the owner of Red Horse Motoring Club, a literal car enthusiast paradise. You're standing in what was, back in the day, Ludwig Motors. Uh, we do car events, car shows, like this weekend with the Low Show. We try to pull everybody together. Let's have some fun. To me, that's what it's all about. The Mark III A59 and the Mark VIII TCR, which, fun fact, it's the first time they've been in America. The cars are here. Let's go check some of them out. Come on. talk to some of these crazy enthusiasts starting with the car parked right next to me you guys probably already know her our good friend Megan how are you today I'm great just seeing the people and their love for these cars man every single car is different everybody has a different story about their build it's just kind of cool this is really awesome and I love that you modified the 38 to say 28 yeah. that's really cool what is your favorite part of this whole entire build I guess the supercharger, because you're not going to see it anywhere else. It's it's one of one. I like that a lot. Tell us about this thing that you have going on. All right, so it was literally a joke. Um, it was originally a two liter eight valve turbo. I should put my engine in your car. It would make people mad, and it would be hilarious, and I'll paint it like a Harlequin. So So it looks like we got something under the cover here, and I can't wait to show you guys what this unveiling actually is. So we are proud to introduce to North America the 2023 Volkswagen Golf R 20th Anniversary Edition for North America. All right, to tell us a little bit more about Pottstown and the Low Show, we're gonna pass it over to Jamie. Well, Charles, we are here in my hometown of Pottstown, Pennsylvania. Well, 400 of my closest Volkswagen friends and, well, the Volkswagen Golf R 20th Anniversary Edition unveiled just mere minutes ago behind me in front of the main stage just for the show. And then two cars flown in from Germany from Volkswagen Classic. Be still my heart. And it's just such an amazing honor to have you, to have our friends, and to have hundreds and hundreds of Volkswagen cars here to join us. But again, thank you so much for coming and enjoy. Awesome, Jamie, thanks for that. Back to you, Bob. All right, it's time for Treffin Trivia. Let's go. Are you ready? I am ready. Force Fed Trivia. I think so. What was the slogan used for 1960s Beatle campaign? What does CC stand for? Oh, that's a good one. I want to say. Some of these questions, I don't even know the answers. Ask me an old school, like Audi question. Here's a good one. In the year 2000, Volkswagen set the Guinness World Record for how many people they fit in a Beetle. What is the meaning of the German word for Jetta? Okay, trivia time. Let me try that again. Do you see that brain stop? It just happened right before your eyes. I don't, uh, I don't know if it has anything to do with wind or something like that, but I know like... I think we give them that. It's jet stream and I, I, th I think that counts. 
What two words merge to create the name Tiguan? Oh no. Um... What are the three models of Volkswagen built in Chattanooga? Uh, built in Chattanooga, I want to say the GTI. Tiguan. T in the U.S., what was the Passat called before it was called the Passat? CC. Okay, next up. Okay. What does it mean if your VIN starts with a W? It was made in Wolfsburg? It was made in Germany. Correct. Thank Just you. Throw the ding up that he got it right. If your VIN starts with a three, where was your car built? Do you want to phone a friend? Yeah, that's my friend. I'm going to phone him. He says Mexico. Mexico is correct. That is a whole lot of sadness. I've been in the Volkswagen community for probably 16 years now. I've always just loved the, the togetherness that everyone has. Everyone's just chill. Everyone's just hanging out. It's always great. It's amazing. The people, the new friends that I made here, it's, it's fantastic. Volkswagen is so innovative and that's one of the reasons why we love them, right? They bring people together and they just have like really cool features that like everyone can just geek out over and I just like we're out here just geeking out. I love it. I love it so much. All right, that's a wrap for the Low Show. I think we've all had enough V-Dub love for one day, so I will see you guys on the next one.